all the things in the world. A demon who wears someone's face. I imagine it makes trusting others risky. Without trust, how would we build alliances? Or friendships? It's easy to speak well of trust when yours has never been misplaced. I want to show Sarah how I feel, but can't think of the right gift. Ideas? You and Sarah? <laughs> That's a tricky one, actually. It's hard to know what she wants without knowing who she is. You should... You should give her something you think she might like. Doesn't help, I know. Good luck. Nothing right now. Perhaps in a bit. someone to talk your ear off I think I can oblige I want to give Sarah a gift to show her how I feel any suggestions you and Sarah huh good one that'll make some eyes twitch a gift though uh, tricky business is it too obscure is it too on the nose will it be taken as intended oh it's a pain in the ass I, I wouldn't worry about it if there's something she wants she'll say well, Sarah's not big on subtext. No footnotes, or, you know, really, words of any sort. What can I do for you? I want to show Sarah how I feel. Any suggestions for a good gift? You wouldn't... I see. You won't help? I can't. She's turned her back on what we should be. I have no insight in what she could want. Something human and fleeting, no doubt. Roger, that Chanty fellow who led us through the mountain from Haven. You know he died, I assume. Got us as far as the camp, and then that was it. Oh, that's too bad. I helped him walk. He talked about you quite a bit. He just needed to be sure you were on Draste's chosen. He was terrified of what it meant, if it were true. But in the end, he believed. He asked me to tell you he was sorry. It seems he was a good man, after all. Sometimes you discover things where you least expect. Anyway, we can talk about something else if you'd rather. I'm looking for ideas for something to give Sarah, to show her I'm serious. Right. You want the lover's red. Nestle a Feltamont rose to your heart and take it to the west peak of Mount Azazet. As dawn breaks, bare your chest. Nine seconds of that cold sun will tease the petals to the color of love's first blush. Is... Is that a thing? No. Complete nonsense. As is trying to please that imp with any material gift. Good luck, Inquisitor. It's not a hunt I'd bet on. You've made such intriguing design choices for the castle, my dear. They must be inspired. Thank you, Vivian. I'm glad you approve. When things have settled down a bit, I will take you to Val Royo and introduce you to my seamstress. And appearances are important. We can't have you mistaken for a commoner. I suppose it's important to show we're an authority to be respected. Not just respected, my dear. Awed, feared, aspired to. You command an army of the faithful, outfitted by the coin of the nobility. 
You must be a woman who commoners aspire to be, and to whom nobles bow. My actions will inspire them. Appearances don't matter. It would be a lovely world if we were all judged purely on our conduct, my dear. But it would not be this world. The stories of your accomplishments will spread, and with them, doubt. Are you truly the woman from the tales? They will question what they've heard, but they will believe what they see. They must see someone greater than legends. And if I don't live up to the stories, what can I expect from the disappointed masses? There is nothing more vicious than the public turning on a fallen idol. They will blame you for not being the hero they wanted. Their anger will be like a hornet's nest smashed open. Simple and vicious. Respect that, and they are easy to control. Did you need something, darling? I want to show Sarah I'm serious about her. Any ideas about a gift that would say it? Oh, for... Seriously. This is why you've bothered me. Just shave something rude into your privates, dear. She won't get the redundancy. I'm not doing... You are no help. In this matter, I'm glad. Inquisitor? How may I help you? What's going on? I want to get Sarah something to show I'm serious. Thoughts on the right gift? So, you and her, huh? <laughs> nice. But you're right. It's hard to say what she'd want that she hasn't just taken and gotten bored with already. I'm drawing a blank. I'd offer positions or something, but I play a power game, and she's all about the limber. <laughs> nice catch, though, boss. Good on you. Planning troop movements now. I'm trying to imagine what it will look like when we're done. All of this once belonged to the Tevinta Imperium. Andraste changed that, as did the Blights. As for what will come next, I cannot guess the Maker's plan. We make the world a better place. Because everyone agrees on what better means. I know. I want a world where people trust the Chantry, and that trust is respected. I want to respect tradition, but not fear change. I want to right past wrongs, but not avenge them. And I have no idea if my wanting these things makes any of them right. Even if they're not right, they're certainly admirable. Some would disagree. They would call it heresy. That didn't sound like the ravings of a heretic, Cassandra. Perhaps not. But it takes precious little effort to paint even an act of compassion as damaging. Tell me, what guides you? You make decisions that shake the world, yet always seem so assured. I wish I had your confidence. I do what must be done. What other choice is there? The demands of the moment. Exactly. Think of it. Like Andraste long ago, once again the fate of Thedas will be determined by a woman. It makes me proud to know you. I hope we can call each other friends. I hope so too. We still have a long road to travel, Inquisitor. Wherever it takes us, I'm glad you're here. Hello again. I want to give Sarah a gift that shows I'm serious about her. Any idea what she would like? 
You, our Herald, and... Sarah? Oh, you certainly go out of your way to make things difficult, don't you? I've no suggestions. At least none she would willingly accept, such as gaining purpose or an actual profession. If there's nothing else, I'll get back to work. Of course. Our hero strode the winding road, defiant of the mire. Uncertain fall for home and home when met by a monster well, mire. Let me know if you find it. A man his kin through blood and sin. A bastard of the gloom. A he hates it all because of the darkness behind the door. Some doors should stay shut. I want to show Sarah how I feel. You have a different perspective. Any ideas on what to get her? A gift that means feelings. So it's something it isn't. I don't think that works outside the Fade. Or in it. Don't give her a gift in the Fade. That would go very bad. She would make it very bad. I'm not much help. Sorry. What's going on? What is this? You look serious. I'm racking my brain for something you'd like. I have to admit, I just don't know. Well, that's sweet, but what are you on about? You gave me a gift, sort of. I asked everyone and still don't know what to get you in return. Wait, wait, wait. You went to everyone and said I was your lover. Right to their faces. They must have. Oh, Vivian must have puckered pinky tight. Best gift ever. I've never kept you a secret. I don't think it'd be possible. There's a difference between knowing and having it rubbed in your face, yeah? Hey, I'll show you. On your face. Because I said, just come here. 